Hi everyone, I'm Gord. Today we're going to be building robots and wrestling them with one another. Here we go. Here is uh, a robot on the left, 33358. That boy is going to be wrestling his robot against the girl's robot on the right, the 257 robot. Which one do you think is going to win? Well, first of all, we look at the first three, that blue three, and then we see which of the girl's numbers are more than that three. Oh, it's the five and the seven. There's two numbers that are more than the three. Well, that's true of all of these uh, threes. Or there's exactly two numbers that are more. For the five, how many numbers in the girl's robot are more than that blue five? Oh, there's only one, it's only the seven. So. That's, uh, that gets a one. How many numbers on the girl's robot are more than eight? Oh, zero, that's easy. Okay, now we're gonna do multiplication. So we do three times two, six. Three times two, that's six again, six again. Five times one, that's five. Eight times zero is zero. We're gonna be adding up all of those and numbers at the bottom, six plus six plus six plus five plus zero. And that is the robot's score in this wrestling match. So six plus six plus six plus five, that is gonna be 23. Now let's see how the girl's robot did. First of all, we have the two. Let's compare that two and see how many numbers on the boy's robot are more than two. Oh, all five, all five. So that's, that's uh, gonna be a five there. How many are more than five? Only one, only the eight. How many are more than seven? Only one again. We're now going to multiply. Two times five is 10. Five times one is five. Seven times one is seven. Add those all together and you get 22. So in this case, the boys robot won, but by just a little bit, just a little bit. So that's how you do robot battles. You should now go off as a class and explore. And you know maybe you want to set some limits. Maybe the numbers that you choose, maybe you can't have more than five, and maybe you can't have less than, maybe less than three. No, oh, you can try just putting one number in, I suppose. Yeah, you can create your own rules, discuss it as a class. What rules do you think are reasonable? Then I want you to experiment fighting against each other, battle, wrestling against each other. And then I want you to come up with some ideas. What makes a good robot? Okay. Here are some, what some other kids did. So um, on the left, we have this robot. Which one do you think is going to win? And you can see, again, we multiply all of these together and we end up with, again, the one on the left wins. <laughs> so it seems like we have a, um, uh, just barely winning. Um, I wonder how many of yours win by just um, one point. Can you ever have a tie? If the two robots aren't the same, can you ever have a tie? These are the kind of questions that you should be asking yourselves.